If there is one thing people love about the MCU, it's when everything ties to Iron Man. You know, villain histories, suits, the whole thing. People just love it when everything connects to Iron Man. Yeah, that was sarcasm, they don't. Now let's talk about why Taskmaster might have a bigger connection than most people want to Iron Man. So as always, before we see the movie, this is of course a rumor, but there's a lot to go on. So what has happened is recently people are looking at all the merchandise that's coming out for Black Widow and people naturally want to see what Taskmaster has to offer, you know, action figure collectors and all that. So there's various products out there that show us Taskmaster and specifically there's one of a visor. Now the visor happens to have the same exact technology look that Iron Man uses in the MCU. You know that view from where we see the face from the inside and we see the heads up display and it's displayed on the helmet from our point of view. Well, it just so happens that the Iron Man toys, this is exactly how they display them with the same exact images and same exact type of reticles that has been spotted when it comes to Taskmaster, leading many people to believe that his technology, his suit, and what it's based on is going to be a direct connection to Iron Man, possibly even stolen Iron Man tech, if not an actual retrofitted Iron Man suit. So this could realistically be it, you know, um, I think right now this would be a stupid move. Honestly, I think this is a dumb mistake. There's already tons of people who are just sick of everything having to connect to Iron Man, like Spider-Man, for example, his suit, you know, other villains. Everything kind of drives everything back to Iron Man. And again, making Taskmaster just somebody that maybe has an Iron Man suit and has that heads up display kind of leads you in the direction that, hey, maybe he's not exactly as he is in the comics and maybe they're going to pull another fast one on us. And again, Iron Man has been known to do this. You know, they did it with the Mandarin. So I don't know if that's their intent or not, but as clear as day, the toys are indicating such a thing. Now, maybe it could be that the toys are using it as a visual aesthetic, but then again, what would be the point of that? I, I just don't get that. And if you look at the various toys out there, they all tend to feature the same exact thing. So I think more so than not, this is factual and he is somehow going to owe something to Iron Man and a direct connection to him for better or for worse. So you guys, let me know how you feel about this one. Are you just getting sick of Iron Man? Even post-death, even though this takes place when he's still alive, he still seems to have an impact on pretty much everything they do.